In this tutorial, I'll guide you through the process of animating an RPC semi-truck cab and trailer. We'll begin by placing the RPC semi-truck into the scene. When it's placed, a spline is automatically generated. Right-click to end the spline. Next, our animator is going to convert this to an editable spline so that the vertices can be modified. He then refines the angles between the vertices so that when the cab is dragged through the scene, it will move more like an actual truck would move. I'm not going to go into detail on the process used to refine the spline, but if you watch closely, you can see the steps that our animator took. So as you can see here, this is not the way a truck would normally move along the spline. So to address this, we're going to place a second truck to the scene. Now when you place this truck, you'll want to make sure that you right click so that no spline is generated. Okay, we'll go back to the first truck and then we're going to turn off the trailer for the first truck. We'll go to the second truck, turn off the cabs. And then we'll also deactivate the trailer jack. And that's automatically enabled when the cab gets turned off. Okay, and then we'll just align the two using the pivot point for the x-axis. So now we'll get something that looks kind of like this. The two are attached, but we're going to be able to move them independently. Okay, we'll go ahead and link these two objects together. And uh, next, we'll go in and change the link info for the Z rotational value. So now we'll get something that looks kind of like this, which is not how we want our truck to behave. So to address this, we're going to keyframe the movements of the trailer. Uh, you can use the set key button to keyframe and then use the rotate tool to rotate the trailer. And now we'll just click on the trailer and rotate it. And we're going to set up a tweening here between these different keyframes so that that movement is a smooth process. In the end, what we'll get is the truck consisting of two pieces that will take a turn realistically.